the cable's gonna run through. And the fiber cable will go up the wall through a small hole that goes into the ceiling, which leads to the attic. And from the attic, the fiber cable will run to my network panel, which is located in my master bedroom closet. After I get the fiber cable into the network panel, I can then install the fiber modem. I probably could have done this myself, but why take a chance of falling through the ceiling and of course hurting myself? So sometimes it's better to call a professional. And that's exactly what I did. All right, the fiber is now in my network panel. Now I need to call CenturyLink to connect the black fiber optic cable to my white fiber optic cable. Then we'll install the modem. And all we have to do is plug in the power supply, plug in the fiber optic cable to the modem, and plug in a Cat6 cable from the modem to my router. And that's it. 